quick setup here, and then we'll get to the top. So, same thing as we learned yesterday with Joey, the steering wheel, we're gonna do the same thing, right? We're gonna make contact with our back hand. My back hand always makes contact, right? We don't wanna reach out with this, top, this front hand, we just like extended. So my back hand always gonna make contact, and I'm going to the head. Ever remember yesterday, last night, Joey's session, steering wheel, same thing. This way, so it goes to you guys. Same thing, I'm gonna go ear to shoulder, and I'm gonna rotate him this way. I wanna bring this one to me, right? I want this foot, I'm gonna drop here. So I gotta bring it to me. I'm gonna circle him hard, go ear to shoulder. Watch his ear, shoulder, circle. Now once his foot is lined up, notice how my, my leg is right in line with his foot. Now that we're here, I'm dropping hard with his head, trying to bring his chest down to his knee, okay? This one, I don't wanna see this. I don't wanna see ankle, see all this extension, see how my arms are long and his head's up really hard to get it, right? So when I'm down here, I circle him, boom. I want to bring his head as far down as I can. See how his head, his chest is at his knee? Now that I'm here, my hand's going to drop. I want to think about putting my forearm along his shoe. This way. Think about putting your forearm right here and blocking that shoe, grabbing the heel. Now from here, I want to throw him at an angle, okay? I don't want to go straight this way, right? Because he may kick out, go the other way. I'm gonna go at an angle, okay? So I drop, boom, heavy over his chest. Notice how my foot's still loaded? Drop my hand, throw him through. See how I kept a hold of this ankle? Now I cover and get my points, okay? So one more time from the beginning. James, do a transition. Okay. I'm here, I make contact, boom, back hand. Get to my collar tie. Steering wheel, ear to shoulder, get that leg in front. Now I drop, get his head and his chest down, penetrate, throw him here, okay? Once we get there, this way now. Boom, we land, I wanna cover, I wanna cover into my tight waist, okay? So as I come on top, I'm immediately looking to cinch this arm underneath, right? Just like this. As I do that, I'm gonna keep rotating towards this arm side, I'm just gonna do a little cheap tilt. All I'm gonna do is collect this arm, Tilt him up. This is a tilt, I'm just looking for a couple swipes, and he's gonna roll back over, okay? So it's easier off the takedown. One more time. I go here, contact, steering wheel, drop, throw it, boom. As he's recovering, I'm climbing up, catching tight waist, step around to his back, see how my knee blocks his hip. This arm's tight, okay? As tight as I can get it. All I'm gonna do, go to this arm, tilt him up. I'm gonna collect, I'm gonna drive forward over his shoulder, right to this arm, tilt him up here. It's gonna be quick. One, two, he's gonna kick out, drop back on top, okay? Does everyone understand? Any, yep, one more time. Yep, I'll do the, the whole thing. Just the tilt, okay. So he lands, I ankle pick him, boom. My arm that was on the ankle pick comes to tight waist, okay? I'm trying to slip it in there as fast as possible. Now, I'm gonna bring my knee right to my hand. That's what's gonna cinch it up. Here it's loose. I step, cinch it up. So I can pick him up here. I can pick him up. You hear that, that noise? I'm cinching, my knee comes up, boom. All I do here, go right to this arm. See how he's on his elbow? I'm just gonna collapse that elbow, drive him forward, right to his back. So I'm here, collapse him forward, flex him in my hips. See how he's sitting in my hips right here? Quick two, one, two, my partner's gonna kick out. Back to his belly, okay? It's pretty simple, just a little cheap tilt from our ankle pick. And one important area there from that transition from the ankle pick, what James does really well, as he's shooting his arm for that tight waist, he's keeping that pressure by driving off his toes so he can't, as he's cutting his round, he can't go back up because he's getting all that pressure put on him. So as you're transitioning from your shot, making sure you're driving off your toes and cinching that right away so that whoever you're taking down is gonna have a hard time being able to get to a solid base and be able to get out. So we wanna utilize all that time. Good work. Good. Any questions from anyone? You guys think we can work this? All right, let's do it, one, two.